All right, hi everybody. Spawn kind nine twenty two. Okay, did fairy tale? It's uploading now. Kenichi. Yes, Kenichi. This one was. Whoo! I'm almost inclined to give this a five. That's how. That's how crazy it was. I'm almost inclined to give this a five. But. Better judgment, I'll give it a four. Um, this one was called, if I can, Miyu versus Rimi Conclusion. I think. Um, now. Pretty much what happened in this one um, was 514 was obviously, as it states, the conclusion between Rimi and Miyu. Rimi ended up using Saido Kyotsu, which is the same technique that Ryoto-sama, Ryoto, you know, Odin, used against Kenichi during... The very beginning, I'm talking Ragnarok. That's a long time ago. That's when he used it. That was the last time he used it. Now, he used it. And we saw what the... For Christ's sake, he's in a fucking wheelchair. So, her using it is even worse. Now, pretty much, you know, she's stating, you know, look, Fringy, this is the real power of Rimi's love. Yeah, Rimi's love. Oh, by the way, uh, Rimi's love's gonna get you killed. So, and the entire time, Ryoto is talking to Ogata, and he's basically telling him, you gotta stop this. This will kill her. Bet, and then she's saying, what, what are you asking Ken so desperately? And he says, stop, Atlanta, stop, Rimi. And she's like, huh? And why? And she's like stating, you know, she's basically saying like, why do you want him to stop me? And... And... You know, she's very... Con she doesn't want that. She wants to continue fighting. And defeat... And then she's like thinking that the reason why he's saying that is because, oh wait, no, that, my bad, that's not the name of the chapter. The name of the chapter is At the End of Love. I apologize. And basically, she's like saying, do you think Rimi won't win? That's what it was in the beginning. And the entire time, Kenichi's fighting, you know, um, um, Berserker. And Berserker wants him to show him Um, the same move that he used before, and Berserker's able to counter it, and so on and so forth. And counter it. He was able to reject it. Reject the whole thing and everything. Um, and, you know, he's talking to Ogata, uh, Ryoto, and he's basically saying, what's the matter, Ryoto? Ryota? Ryoto? He's saying... Isn't perf He's saying that the technique, Ryoto, is not perfect. That the person using will be heavily damaged and even, and even get disabled or worse, die. That's what he's basically saying. The thumbnail is probably gonna, I'm probably gonna use the final page for the thumbnail on this one because this was a pretty intense fight, and he's just you know playing the him. And he's like saying, however, I'm not going to. He says, you should be able to understand my ideal. That's why you became my disciple, isn't it? And then that's when he states. But I, and he states, I, but I don't think Alante decided to use that technique after thinking so deeply. And he's saying, stating that her muscle tissue is starting to rupture. 
And she's like saying, I will become a strong woman. <laughs> because Ryuto Sama likes strong women. And that's when Ryuto decides to just ignore Ogata and go right in with his wheelchair. And he's and Ogata said, Your words can't reach her anymore. Um, and she, he's saying that, oh, she's just a massive martial arts now. And he's saying, stop Remy. And then both Ryoto and Kenichi then feel the need to jump into the fight and stop them. And uh, a few words they say here and there. And what ends on happening is a big explosion... Rimi falls down, and Miyu falls down, and within that collision, she spits up blood, and it says this extensively violent, violent fight reaches the end. Rimi seeks on the chest to her beloved Ryuto. Next time, another Miyu clear file. And that's what happened. So, pretty much, Mew got, Rimi got, she, she, she's, she's, I mean, come on. She's spitting up blood. And the one thing I think, I think, I forgot to mention what Miu and Rimi said to each other when they were closing in on each other. Let me just go find that. Um, she says, vanish so that Rio to someone will look up to Rimi. And Rimi is saying, I could feel the screams coming from her body. I must find life between death and murder. So that's what happened there. And, uh, you know. And it's kind of funny it ended like this. Now, the thing I'm trying to figure out from the ending of this chapter is what Ryuto is going to do now. This falls all on Ogata's hands. If she is dead. Really. Or she is pa paralyzed to the point where she can't be a martial artist anymore. This is really all on, all on his hands because he allowed her to use that technique without stopping her at all. And this is like the darkness behind Ogata. And at some point, I look at him, and I think he's not such a bad guy. But then I realize he is a bad guy. He is kind of villainous. He is being mean what he does. And I won't be surprised if Ryoto tell, looks at him and says, Fuck you, I'm, I'm leaving. Because, truth be told, he might fall. Kenichi! Yeah! I mean, I, I got a. F I was looking at a few things in, in that chapter. People left a few comments on the manga here site, and they were saying that maybe what might happen is Kenichi might chat might control that technique that Rimi used. I don't know, I mean, or even become a master, which, you know, who knows, that. But, overall, this was a good chapter, I thought. I really liked it, the fight was just, too intense. And her gave her spitting up blood in the end, that was, that was pretty, that was pretty cool. I liked that shit, that was awesome. That was some awesome shit. So, overall, this was good. Liked what I saw, 4 out of 5. So yeah, I misread the Medica Box chapter. Yeah, that was... Yeah. But I, I believe, to a lesser extent, Kimichi was the good chapter this week. From the three that I reviewed. You know? Because, I mean, Fairy Tale was okay after the last two shit bombs. And, you know, Medica Box was, was good too, to a certain extent, but I shouldn't have given it a four out of five. But this one was good... Because it had a, a dramatic ending, you know? And the whole thing between 
Ryuto, and Ogata. So, that was another thing that got me for this week's chapter of, of uh, uh, Kadichi. But yeah, pretty awesome shit. Pretty awesome shit. So, yeah. And, uh, well, we'll see how what, what concludes from next week. Next week's gotta be huge. It's probably gonna be huge. It's gonna be freaking awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. You know? God knows what's gonna happen next week. Phew! But I, 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 I'm not too sure if it's going to happen this way. But for some reason, I have a feeling that Ryu Tu, Ryu Tu, to, is going to leave. If she dies. Or she's really pff, gone. Um, I don't think she's dead, though, Weeby. I, mm, I don't think she's dead. She might be paralyzed like him to a certain extent but uh we'll have to wait and see on that but anyway that's all i got for you guys this has been bonkai 922 i'll see you guys later Remy, dead Remy. listen i don't think love entitles you to sacrifice your body to the point where you are in a wheelchair just say it just say it but anyway, this is Valkyrie right there too. I'll check you guys later.